take a minute to introduce you to one of my good friends, Sean. Sean is flat out uh, just one heck of a kid. He's taught me so much in my life. And, uh, you know, Sean. <laughs> oh, man. Sean is. Uh, got that. He's taught me a lot. Taught me how to love unconditionally and just flat out good young man. And he's, today he's helping us out, spending the night at our house, aren't you? Come to church with us tomorrow. Flat out good young man. Our whole family loves him just like family. You know, the other day, a guy I work with, he told me, he said, you can't change the world, Luke. And I thought to myself, when he said it, my the earth just stopped. Like I could hear a pin drop. <clears throat> and it hit me all of a sudden like, he believes that. And an adult, he believes it. You can't change the world, Luke. I thought to myself, what a sad world. He, I don't think he really professes to be a Christian, certainly not an active Christian. But when he told me that, it just shook me. He said, you can't change the world. He believes it. I, I was raised in a home where my dad thought we could change everything. You know, sometimes I, I think a friend like mine here, he's got it right. We have got it messed up. This guy here, he doesn't know how to hate. You love everybody, don't you, Sean? This, this is a fine young man. And, you know, his, his parents are just A1 grand people. And I told them that one time, and they both started crying. This young man has changed my life. Got a love for the Lord in him. Um, he loves the things of God. Loves everybody. He would prefer his neighbor to have something over himself. I'm thinking, you talk about the way things should be. That's ah, just two minutes worth, you guys. We can change the world. We are the salt of the earth. Christians, don't be disheartened. What's happening to our country is horrible. There is no doubt about it. But this is the greatest time in America ever. For ye are a chosen generation and a royal priesthood, called out from among them to be separate, saith the Lord. You know, God didn't ask Peter, Paul, James, John, any of those to live in this time period. He called us. When I go to Walmart, I am the salt of the earth. I am representing God's people. Right, John? God bless you all. Thanks for putting up with my little rants. Um, hopefully you'll see Sean in a lot of our videos. Do you like being in videos? You're, you're a little shy in front of the camera, aren't you? No. He's not. He doesn't have a girlfriend right now, even though he wants to marry my wife, don't you? And uh, I'll tell you what. Other than that, though, he's a pretty good guy, even though he wants me to fall off the tractor, get run over, and get married. He wants yes, to marry. Sir. Ah! <laughs> God bless you all. Did you want to say goodbye? Bye. You got to look at the camera. <laughs> Special thank you to all my new subscribers. Hey, if you haven't subscribed, it's free. Take a minute to do that. Hit the thumbs up button, share us on social media, and leave us a comment. Thanks for watching.